Okay, friends. How's everybody doing? This is one thing we haven't talked about yet. How to hold a stick. If we have talked about this, you probably forgot. So I want you to remember. Look closely here. See how I'm holding this? What am I doing? Am I holding it like this? Am I holding it like this? For this exercise, I want you to hold it like this. There's the tip where we're playing. Here's the end. Right? I want you to be able to do this. Alright. I'll wait a few seconds. See that? Here's why we do this. This lets gravity let the stick fall. Look how the stick is falling. It's moving with this. These two fingers let it slide down. This way, the only thing that needs to move is my wrist. Look, my elbow's gonna stay still. My shoulder's gonna stay still. The only thing moving right now is my wrist. You know, my left hand too. See this? Stick is moving, elbow staying still. Right? Same thing when I do this. Look what stops it. It's the back of my hand. Now here is the next level. I can have this move from my pinky. And even my wrist stays still. Look at that. My shoulder's not moving. My elbow's not moving. My wrist's not moving. Just my pinky's moving. Yeah, my wrist moves a little bit. My elbow moves a teeny bit. My shoulder can move if I want it to. But there is where we get our movement when we play with our sticks on the bucket, right? Lots and lots of pinky doing this. And this is something you have to practice. It doesn't come like right away. Or maybe it does for you. But that's what I want you to practice this week. You got some sticks. Practice making as little movement as you can make with your wrists and no movement with your elbow and shoulder so that you can make your you can make the sticks do this Where'd my pinkies go <laughs> okay have a great time